It is finally here, the Triumph's dirt bike release date and the motocross racing plans have been released. Hey what's up guys, Rado here and I'm super excited because I just saw that uh, news that Triumph is releasing the dirt bike and the motocross racing plans and I have to talk about it, I have to share it with you. Uh, as a fellow European, uh, even though I live in the USA, I'm from Europe originally, I'm really pumped that there is another European manufacturer that is making dirt bikes and actually has a really good ambitions to come and compete at the highest level in motocross and actually get some titles that's their plan and uh, they're getting together with a really good people they have really serious intentions here so uh, this is what triumph came up with today 2023 late 2023 the first 250 four-stroke motocross dirt bikes will be released and will be coming into production so we will be able to see them to buy them to ride them to test them and all that good stuff so they are going to start racing first in uh, europe which uh, honestly was a little bit surprising i was kind of hoping they will come and race usa at the same time but according to the press release that i just read i'll put link below in the description they are going to start racing first in europe fim championship and they will be starting as a 250 team only in the beginning they are going to have two 250 four-stroke dirt bikes mx2 category i believe and then uh, later they will add 450 as they go in the in the following year so according to what they are saying now in 2024 100 percent we can expect to see triumph team at the gates lining up with all these other manufacturers from japan and other european brands there so there will be a triumph team with the two guys in 250 class and then in 2025 they are going to add a 450 class now uh, they're really serious because they got together with Thierry, I'll put his full name below here. Uh, Thierry is one of the most uh, successful uh, people who own the motocross teams in Europe. So uh, he will be teaming up with Triumph. Together they are gonna, going to make a team and they will select the you know, racers, the team and, and all the kind of stuff you need for the successful race team. And they will be competing together, jo uh, you know, joining effort and uh, getting into that FIM championship in 2024. I was hoping they're gonna come and also compete in, uh, in Supercross and Motocross, outdoor season here, outdoor nationals in USA. But I guess we would need to wait a little bit more in USA. They're going to come a uh, little bit later, maybe 2026 or 2025. Uh, let's see what happens over there. Now, Ricky Carmichael, you guys know him, right? Uh, we don't need to introduce Ricky Carmichael here. Uh, GOAT, one of the best motocrosser ever. He was heavily involved with Triumph from the beginning. And uh, I just read what he had to say about the bikes that he just tested in UK. And uh, I'm really excited that uh, this bike is going to be something else. So let me read you what Ricky said. I'm really excited about today's news. It's been a long time coming since the start of this project with Triumph. I have been amazed at just how hard everyone has been working. It must not go without mentioning the whole R&D and engineering group that have been a part of the development of the motorcycle have done an absolutely incredible job. From the first stages of the prototypes, I was really taken back at how well the performance was. Since then, being in the UK testing the newest developments, I can tell you that it has the capabilities of winning at the highest level. And I personally believe the riders, from professional to amateur across the entire range of off-road models, will really like what has been developed. That's from Ricky Carmichael, and uh, that actually means something. So, Ricky is riding these bikes, and he's saying that this is going to be a real deal and uh, people will really, really love them. Not only the racers, but also the people like myself, uh, you know, the weekend warriors that we will really like what is developed. And uh, personally, I'm, I'm really surprised that this manufacturer that has such a long history is actually coming with a new lineup of dirt bikes. Like you would kind of think that maybe the dirt bike and especially the uh, combustion engine uh, is, is kind of dying breed because everybody is coming with these electric bikes now and then emissions and pollution and noise and whatnot. But we diehard motocross fans, we hope that uh, these motocross bikes will never go away. And I think Triumph is kind of proving to us that, hey, this industry is not dead. If it would be dead, then we would not spend a lot of time and effort and, uh, and uh, you know, money to go into R&D and development of the new lineup of the motocross uh, and off-road bikes, enduro bikes. 
uh, that are you know powered by gasoline so i have a lot of hope our industry is not going <laughs> somewhere it's staying and it's actually growing so i'm really pumped now let me know below in the comments what you think about this new uh you know triumph coming to the racing a little bit bump that is not in usa and a little bit bump that is two years from today uh, you know i actually talked to triumph uh people triumph usa people at the las vegas show about uh, six months ago and they were telling me that end of this year we will see some bikes and according to the press release and uh, all the work that they've been doing it be, it's been postponed for another year so it's taking longer than we uh, expected but hey it's not it's not easy it's not something that you do every day to to come up with a brand new bike they're trying to do something different i don't think it will be just uh you know ktmds and husky dead and put it together i don't think so i think it will be brand new dirt bike a lot of r d went into it and uh, they're gonna bring some uh, british heritage uh, with that bike i'm hoping for that all right my friends so let me know below in the comments what you think about this whole triumph thing and don't forget whatever you do stay motivated see you guys later